for all being fucking honest and, and straightforward here, go, guys don't want to fucking bang ugly chicks. It's that simple, okay? And anyone that thinks they do, you're probably lying. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. I am your best option for getting more girls, a higher quality of girls, and landing your dream girlfriend. Okay, I have an optimized, evolved system that I relentlessly optimized over the course of 15 years, and it works extremely systematically and effectively. Okay, if you want to get the results of that system, jump on a free 30 minute call, hear how we can help you, how we can get you to all your goals and fix all your weaknesses in the game, okay? Also, if you're not yet a subscriber, please subscribe below and press the notification bell for new videos, okay? In this video today, we're gonna do blind speed dating of 12 girls. There's gonna be one guy speed dating 12 girls blindly. Got some fucking sun in my face, but it's all good. All right, so let's fucking jump right in here. You traveled recently? Last year, I was abroad in Taiwan. That's right, I think I remember that, my bad. I don't think I told you. Oh. Are you mixing me up already? <laughs> Are you nervous at all? A little bit, but I mean, I can't see him, so everything's all good. Is this- Are you nervous at all? A little- Is this dude's name Cash? His little name is Cash, with a C. A little bit, but I mean, I can't see him, so everything's all good. We asked Cash how much cash it would take to date 12 potential matches. <laughs> <laughs> My name's the kid fucking Cash. Do you think you'll be able to establish a connection with somebody even though you can't see them? I mean, I can try. I make no promises though. We'll see. Should we bring them out? Bring them out, bring them out. This dude seems cool. Oh my god. Another lineup of fucking average trash. This looks like uh, ex-girlfriends of the the red pill coaches, actually they're hotter, way hotter than the red pill coaches girls, who are we kidding? But yeah, I don't think I would bang any of these girls, if I'm being honest. Yep, absolutely none of them. Let's see how many we got, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, there's three unseen, maybe those redeem. Ashley, you're first, go ahead. And have the first seat. ugly nine. Ashley, what's up, I'm, I'm Cash, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm Diana, nice to Diana, meet you. Diana, Dirty yeah. Diana. Dirty Diana. <laughs> dirty Diana. Diana. Oh, you're gonna start? Okay, oh. no, I'm just kidding. Oh. Um, I'm Rebecca. Rebecca, that's that's my cousin's name, it's kind of awkward. <laughs> What's your name? I'm, I'm Irene, I'm sorry. This one's maybe bangable. So nervous. No, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Um, where are you from? I'm actually from Taiwan. What do you do? Um, I'm currently a nursing student at Biola. I actually watched the whole season of American Horror Story to like get me ready for it. So that's where you base your uh, career decision off of, was uh, American Horror Story? Yes. What do you do? Um, I play professional soccer in Orange County. I'm a nursing student. Okay, I like that. Yeah, I'm like CPR certified. Ooh, okay, okay. Because you uh, take my breath and no, I'm just kidding. That was a, that was Ooh, a very good nice take up line. I like to... See, versus... <laughs> this chick's fucking disgusting. Um, basically... The, uh, <laughs> well, a bit of an unpleasant image here. There you go. Um, you know, Mystery talks about at length how women are attracted to survival and replication value, okay? Your ability to provide for the young, take care of the young, etc., solve problems, this and that. Men in the traditional, traditional tribal system, okay, back in evolutionary psychology, roots, uh, they were there to protect the women and care for them and all this kind of shit, okay? So they're looking for those kind of characters. That's why if you carry yourself strongly, you lead other men, confidence, etc., being sure of yourself, okay? If you're like, oh, I think I can maybe provide, uh, uh, right, that, and you're just like meek and, and they're mild-mannered and all this stuff, none of that's attractive and it has evolutionary roots, okay? But a man is attracted, at least at first, and, you know, arguably throughout most of the duration, Largely in part to a woman's looks, physical looks. Okay, so men as as an have an advantage. Okay, even if you're not that good looking, you can still maximize your SMV, your sexual market value, and you can make up for things with game. Okay, but as a woman, if you're not that attractive, you're kind of fucked, right? So the guy, like deep down, doesn't really give too much of a shit what any of these girls have to say. I would venture to guess. Okay, he's more curious who's the hottest one, as you saw in some of these other reaction videos I did, when they were eliminating different girls. They're eliminating 
the ones that are ugly, but they're just like blaming on other shit, right? And and here he can't see any of the girls, so it's just gonna be you know he's like putting out feelers like Dirty Diana. <laughs> he wants the chick to be like, oh yeah, I'm dirty as fuck. All right, let's continue. This chick's fucking kind of gross. Uh, play video games. I'm an up and coming author. <laughs> Ooh. What do you like to do for fun? I like to go to the gym, play soccer, hang out with friends. Shoot, I don't even know. Oh, this is so tough. Everyone seems like really nice people. I'm sorry, it's nothing personal, but uh, Alex, I don't know. I didn't feel like I was I was vibing with her. <laughs> Essence. The, sound, the sounds. I'd good, say Re good call on that one. Becca. That's my cousin's name. So it's yeah, he got rid of that Essence chick because she plays video games. Not that you don't want a DLV on either side. Rather, you don't want to look like a fucking loser. The chick's like, yeah, I play video games. He's probably gonna think, oh, okay, she must be a loser. Too awkward. Beth, she just got the short end of the stick. No particular reason. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so tell me about your ideal first date. Probably hiking or- Oh, this one's not terrible either. These were a couple of the ones that were off the screen. And they're not hot, but- Doing something in nature. I mean, honestly, like anything active, like to get us like to stop thinking and just like have fun. Probably start with something like interact. Anything active, like 69, so that we stop thinking and just suck cock. Like an arcade. Okay, I'm really competitive. You are? I don't, you I don't like, like to win? Music. Sorry, you're gonna be feeling mad a lot of the times. I win a lot. You win a lot, okay. I wanna go somewhere quiet where we can get to know each other and talk. Damn. So maybe like a field, I guess, with okay. like some fried chicken. <laughs> some fried chicken, okay. Wow. <laughs> what kind of restaurant would we go to? I'd be happy with McDonald's, to be <laughs> honest. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, this is one of the more attractive ones. And her vote for where to eat is McDonald's, okay? Which is gonna also make her look like a low-class bitch. <laughs> okay, all right, <laughs> ride or die. We start at McDonald's and then we'll we'll go it up to... Uh, Wendy's? Not Wendy's, we'll, <laughs> we'll go to Red Lobster. How do you feel about uh, edible sushi? Like sushi on my body, <laughs> I'm joking. I'm down for anything. You're down for anything, cool. What's your favorite type of food? <laughs> You're gonna eliminate me as soon as you hear this. <laughs> Salad. My favorite type of food is pasta. Do you uh, like your pasta al dente? I overcook it. Ooh, all right. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Another four. Carmen? I don't know. I didn't feel connected. <laughs> Wang? I didn't really like her. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to eliminate Wang because that's a, uh, another term for a man's cock. Her answers on her ideal first date. Oh, damn. This is hard. <laughs> oh, Wang. Give me that sweet, sweet Wang. Deja. Her overcooking pasta was a, a deal breaker. <laughs> Gives a shit about that. I'd say Ash. I'm sorry. All right, so out of who's left, the one on the right is the hottest. Salad bitch. Let's see what happens here. So, Diana, what's your, uh... The other attractive one, he eliminated because of McDonald's. But I think if he had seen them, he wouldn't have eliminated that one. Deal breaker. I feel like people who are closed-minded, someone that's, like, super into themselves, and they're, like, super, like, cocky and conceited. A lot of people say that I'm, uh, very cocky. Are you cocky? I'm a very humble person, I think. I'd say a, a deal breaker of mine, just people not, not trying new things. Hey, have you same, uh, tried any, yeah. anything new recently? Um, I've been doing yoga. I was just in uh, Spain and London. No puedo hablar español? No. No, <laughs> Un poco? A little bit? Un poco. I can teach you. I camped out in the desert recently. What's yeah. something new you you're, tried recently? You're a trooper for that. Oh, um, yeah. I'm really into, uh, like, cooking new recipes now. So I, like, oh find God. something online. That's the only thing that I watch on YouTube is just cooking videos. Cooking videos? Oh, okay. <laughs> the cute one earned some points with the cooking. Um, I'd say Diana. I'd say Jordan. I don't know. It's just such a tough decision. I like, I just kind of like the other people better, I guess. Cooking videos. All right. So neither are that terrible compared to what was there in the beginning. He could end up with a real freak, freaky looking person, I should say. Congrats. Making it this Ooh, far. Fine. <laughs> but this one's... Definitely not as good as the other. 
What are some of your goals, dream for the future? Since I'm a nursing student, I want to be a registered nurse. Cancer happened a lot in my family, mm -hmm. so I want to like more gear towards cancer patients. How about you? I'd say taking this soccer thing as mm -hmm. far as I could take it. I mean, I if it's know. your passion, right? Yeah, I love yeah. it. I dream about soccer. Do you ever like wake up and you like accidentally like kick something? I have those dreams where I'd be falling sometimes. You wake up just suddenly, like either something's coming at you or you're falling. Oh my gosh, that sounds scary. Like that. Irene. <laughs> That sounds scary. He's like, yeah. And tell me about your uh, your goals. I have a lot. Okay. I really hope to be able to travel in the future. Have you traveled recently? Last year, I was. Here's another zinger that just came to mind. This chick looks like she has a great face for a cum shot. People were like, oh, John Anthony can just say this shit without blinking because his whole channel is demonetized anyways, and he doesn't need that YouTube revenue. It is a very freeing place. But yeah, that's a very majestic face. I to drop a load Broad in Taiwan. That's right, I think I remember that. My bad. Um, I don't think I told you. No. Are you mixing me up already? Someone else is from Taiwan. Oh, yeah, okay. not you, not you. Wow, I caught you right My bad. <laughs> oh, he's fucking up. <laughs> what do you like about Jess? She's a, she's a nursing student. Um, she has a lot, a lot going for her. She likes boba. Irene, I mean, she likes cooking. I like a girl like, that like can cook. Take care of yourself. Can I do both? We can. We can just all be friends. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go with Irene. Very nice. Yeah, but normally, <laughs> normally uh, it's like all over the place compared to looks and personality. So my advice is approach the hot girls. Okay, both on Tinder, only swipe the hot ones that you would bang. Only cold approach attractive girls. Like I've had students now and then that will bang a girl that they would rate like a two out of 10 or a one out of 10. And it bothers them for months, okay? And this isn't meant to be like, that all throughout I've been commenting about their looks, but this, if we're all being fucking honest and, and straightforward here, go, guys don't wanna fucking bang ugly chicks. It's that simple, okay? And anyone that thinks they do, you're probably lying, okay? Um, all this shit that it's in, the, you know, my mom always says, it's, it's inside what counts, blah, blah, blah. yeah, in Disney movies, okay, in reality, that's not true, so, uh, you know, it is what it is, but I advise approaching hot women, and swiping on hot women, and don't set your standards too high when you're a beginner, I have lots of guys come on the program, they only want to bang nine plus, yeah, so does everyone else, but if you haven't even banged a six yet, or a seven yet, you have to drop down the bar a little bit, because you're not ready for the nines yet, Okay, when you're when you're beginner level. Anyways, he lucked out here because he got one of the cuter ones. No hard feelings. <clears throat> wow. <laughs> you're talking to Irene. Oh, we're talking to Irene right now. Oh, cool. <laughs> I liked how she was kind of nervous to begin with. I'm still, I'm, like, I'm so sorry if I see you and you see that I'm like my I'm, my whole body is clammy now. <laughs> oh, jeez. No, it's cool. It's cool. It just <laughs> says that you're you're human, but uh. That salad comment wasn't uh, mm. wasn't doing you anything. You mixing too up good. with me up with another girl wasn't helping you either. I think I thought it took good notes. All right, you guys want to see each other? Go ahead. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. oh my god. I'm Cash. I nice to meet you. My nice to meet you. Clammy. No, it's cool. It's cool. <laughs> now that you see each other, do yeah. you still feel like you would be interested in going out on a date? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Cool. cool. Thank you. Thank you. Let me get your uh, your number. Yeah, of course. <laughs> this is like the first time in these reaction videos where the dude's gone for a number close of the ones that I've done. That's what I was saying in a bunch of other videos. Like even if you're not gonna fucking win, when you're on these little like sessions, like in the one from the teaching men's fashion with the IG supermodel, at least fucking number close so you can hit it up later. <laughs> what was that experience like? I don't know, it's hard to put a face to just words. When I meet people it should <laughs> It's like, it's hard to see who was ugly or not. I'm happy I didn't pick an ugly one. Generally, like, face to face. Here, it's just, like, strictly off answers. I kind of like that, because you could really get a sense of his personality as a whole, rather than doing, like, what humans normally do, and it's just, like, first impression by looks. Is he the type of guy you typically be attracted to? No. Yeah. Not typically. I would probably see how the first date goes. Why do you think he picked you? <laughs> That's her insight. I don't know. All right, that was interesting. Let's yeah. go. And they bring out the fucking freak show again at the end here. Um, okay, so yeah, hooray. 
we didn't learn very much there, I don't think. Except that, you know, <laughs> uh, go learn cooking. No, I mean, it's good to relate to people and this and that. I mean, that girl learned some points there when he's like, and that's what, that's what they should have said. That is a strategy, right? If he's like, oh, I'm pretty much just always trying new recipes. Oh, I watch lots of cooking videos. Okay, boom, you're chosen. Good job. In reality, though, uh, he wouldn't have approached or talked to or been interested in any, most of those girls, <laughs> I'd say any, most of those girls because they weren't attractive enough physically. Okay, so whenever girls are like, hey, what's girl game? How do we get better game as girls? It's basically like wear makeup, go to the gym, and don't be a bitch. And it, excuse me if that sounds shallow, but no guy wants a bitchy girl, no guy wants an ugly girl. It's, you know, and then the rest is, you know, can fall into place as you get to know each other or whatever. That's, I'm just being realistic here. All right, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to learn how to run your dates flawlessly and effortlessly, and have an abundance of dates, okay, so that you're always going on dates with hot girls all the fucking time, getting tons of matches on Tinder, getting lots of phone numbers, jump on a free 30-minute call, we will hook you up and get you all your questions answered, get you set up on lots of dates starting as soon as next week, okay? Also, please let me know you think about all this in the comments, like, comment, and share, subscribe below if you haven't already, press the notification bell for alerts of two new videos a day. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. And Jay don't stand in line, I ain't never had to wait I'm the realest in this game, I ain't never had to fake Just take a look at the scores, I put numbers up on the boards I'm in a section with models, and you're at the bar trying to get out of cluster of fours Fixture, I'm a factor, I'm a boss tycoon My dick smell like two chicks before noon